Sorry about that. My camera cut out, so hopefully I can edit these together. So, I added a few more pieces. These are some sets of ephemera that I purchased. I don't know that I'll use any of these or all of these, but these are from one kit. They're like washi stickers. So I pulled out some that I like that I might stick on there. I don't know how hard it'll be. I don't know if I'll do this before or after. Oops, make sure I'm in frame. So that's the, that is one set. Um, another thing of ephemera that I got is these um, little square papers. So I might just cut out that butterfly and put that down. Maybe tear some of those up. I haven't decided. I like these butterflies. I thought I might cut those out. Or... And like I said, so that's another set. This is a kit that I got. So I have little mushrooms. These are washies also. And butterflies and different things. And there's a tag. So I pulled out and some labels and some papers that I might fussy cut those mushrooms and some more butterflies and paper script. I love that flower. So I don't know how many of these or if any of these I'll use. This is another ephemera pack that I got. These are also washies. Some are in black. Just different little flowers. And then they do have some in color. Like I said, some nice red. So I pulled out about each one of each of those just to look. And yes, they did have some mushrooms. So I got a lot of washi um, things from different packs. So I may put those on after I do some more stuff to this. And then also this one. And I love this butterfly. This is another pack. And let's see if I can get this down. So these are some more washies. Some beautiful butterflies. And like I said, I I might just go back and do these after I figure out like how I'm gonna cut it. Um and then also, this is a washi also, and that's out of one of the kits. I bought a few of them, three of them. I have two, I bought two, gave one to my daughter, and then I bought a second one. And then I do have lots of ephemera. This is just a little piece that got left on my, it's blue and purple. This is actually something, and I have more of those sitting over there, some different ones. I've got all kinds of stuff that I can't remember who it's by, but I pulled it off of, uh, and printed it offline, off of Pinterest, I think. And, uh, so, that's what I've got set over here. Oh, and then just some little random punches that I did, some circles, I picked out some colors, and some little flowers, and, um, like I said, some different size circles, and colors, and those are little things, that, like little cherries, I don't know if I'm going to use any of that either, but some of this I may wait and put there, but those are some of the things I plan on putting on. Um, so... Right now, I think what I would like to do is um, do some stamping. So, I'm going to pull out some stamps. Um, I have this stamp that I purchased from a friend. I got a few dies and some, a few dies from her and some uh, stamps. So this has got some little dots and these are lines. So I'm going to set that right there. I think we're going to use that. I have 
so I'm uh, paints that I bought, crushed metal. I do some painting. I don't know if I'm going to do it in this video or if it's going to be a number three, but I think I am going to use that. Oh, it looks like the gold opened up on me. But I have a uh, crushed metal, some plaque, and this is, uh, I'm not sure, kind of a rosy gold. But anyway, I might use some of those colors. I'm just going to show you some things, what I'm going to use. I got my stamp blocks. Actually, I think I'm going to use this one because it's bigger. And let me just pull you back up a little bit. Sorry about that. I got my different little ink pads. So we're going to do some stamping. I do have some other ink pads. Oh, let me see if I got a black in here. That's what I'm looking for. I'm going to do some in black. I have a dark blue. Mermaid. Oh, that was a blue jay. So, I might use those. I don't know about the other ones, so I'm going to set those back in my drawer for a minute. So I'm just going to start out with those colors. anything on this one. This I did purchase from my friend. Love and Laughter is what this is called. I think I'm going to pull out a couple of those. And do this one here. Boy, they're really stuck on there. Well, I hope they still work. They're like just really stuck on here, like they've sat out in the heat, which is possible. Let me see if I can, give me a second, let me see. Oh, that's really hard to get off of there. I might have to go through and pull all of these off before I ever think about using them. Hopefully they still work. I want to do that one. Since I've got this open, I might as well just see if I can pull off the... No, I have another bird. Actually, I have some of my own stamps that... I'm going to put that back in there. I'm just going to set it down in there. actually have here dies that I purchased from oh yeah 
I like that bird. So I think we're going to use that also. And of course I've got the... Oh yeah, I've used this in my book, so I think we might use that. These are some of the dollar store... Oh, there goes some birds. See, I knew I had birds. Might keep that one out too, we'll see. I love this stamp right here. I've stamped it in some different colors. I don't know, sorry about the glare. Hobby Lobby. Let's just see real fast if I can find some other shapes or things that I want to use on here. do this one right here too okay so those are some stamps I'm gonna we're gonna stamp some things on there so let's go ahead and get started with that I'm gonna move these to the side I'm just gonna put them there I hope this one really works oops wrong side Actually, I'm going to go ahead and stick this one on there, too. I'm not going to put any ink on that one yet, but let's just do some stamping with these. I'm going to do this flower. Hopefully this will work since it's, like I said, hopefully my inks will work. Okay, I'm just going to go ahead and we're going to randomly put Better if I, I don't know that it makes a difference, but Like I said, I'm just going to randomly put there and then I'm going to go ahead and do some of these dots
All right. And I think I want to take that one off of there. On its thing. I'll come back and clean that. I don't know, should we put a couple of lines on there? Oh, there's some little circles. How about Do you do some of these lines and Let's see how they come out? We'll just do Do one more, and I think that's all I'm going to do with that. Let's see, we'll just do that up in this corner. Just if we got anything left on our. Oh, there you go. Whatever is left. Clean it off there. Get that ink off there. All right. So, got a little bit of stamp in there. Get a baby white and just clean those off. All right. We got those cleaned up. Let me just get them back into their package. We'll be done with those. There. Then I think I want to stamp. I actually like these type of stamps, I think, better than some of the other ones. And this, I got at Hobby Lobby. This is this one, and you can color that in. And I got this butterfly one. Um, and then I guess you can get these other two. So, let's do some stamping with this. Hmm, I wonder if this got too hot too. Wow. It's like all the stickies just coming right off of there. Not sure why. Maybe it got laid down the wrong way. I'm not sure. Okay, well, we're going to leave that on there. Okay, I don't want to. It's got a fin. Like I said, it's just peeling it right up the stickiness and taking the picture off so maybe I put it back on wrong when I put it down last time I don't know so let's just see if I can do it this way that's disappointing I'm 
just want to pick it up like this. I don't know, you can barely see that. Let's do this. I'm going to take... Oops, I didn't clean that one. Actually, let's try this. I'm going to try the blue... Blue Jay. It might fade it out a little bit in this here, but I'm going to do one more, I think. Uh, somewhere up in here. the blue just see if we can get whatever's there I can always come back and do some other stamping all right that's disappointing with that but oh well said I don't know if I put it in there back in there wrong because I did use that and I did a little bit of stamping so not quite sure why it's coming off like that okay actually I think that's all the stamping I want to do with that I might do some afterwards. I'll just keep those out. I do see some of my papers coming up, so I'm just going to go back in here and try to get those stuck back down. I'm not going to worry too much about it because I will probably mod podge this. Anyway, so yeah. So like I said, we got some stamping done on it. I don't know, let me try to move it over, sorry. And uh, so the other thing I wanted to do And put a little bit of this rose gold, but let me clean this off first. nice and I'm gonna so I just got a little bit of that rose gold on there and I need a paintbrush so I am not totally when you organize and then you change your mind and move stuff to another spot. Okay. 
Okay, well, maybe we'll just try this one right here. While I think of where I put. This is a big brush, but... I'm just trying to thin down this. Metallic a little bit. And then I'm going to just swipe it all across my page. some of that in. Okay, let me just clean that up. All right. You can see where it, I don't know if you can see the shimmer of it. 